this shit up Cut a cock and turn up, put it down, you wanna split glass Throw it at a stop, got a sneaking like a ninja My leash is on a choker, so you know I make your bitch come Dick just swing back and forth like a pendulum Leave a dick matized, snap my fingers and I'm getting some I'm on Tim, bro, plus one and then some Chuckin' at you, know that motherfucker call it damn some Alright, we're live Yo, 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 what it is, 5 for 30 podcast, it's your boy Bo and my main man. Great, get it, what's good? And we got the one and only EK in the building tonight, coming hey. through to, to bless us with his opinions and his thoughts on uh, our five topics this week, so glad to have you, brother. Hey, He's got man, thanks for having me up here, bro. He's got strong opinions, yeah. too, so I'm ready for yeah. this shit. Fun. This is gonna be fun. I'm very excited. I gotta straighten up my hat for this shit a little bit, you know. Yeah, right. no, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm excited about that. I'm like, all right, what are we gonna talk about? What's up? <laughs> so we are gonna start. Uh, we are gonna start with this tip story. Yeah, let's get into this tip story. Should we start with the video first? Yeah, go ahead and roll the video. Well, no, let me let me, let me intro it real quick. So this is at a show in Indiana. Uh, uh, through a crevice, a hole in the wall, Ti got caught creeping. Look at this. Ah, uh, here she comes. Damn. So she is. She, she's an actress. Her name is um, I believe is Aaliyah uh something. I can't uh, remember. It's uh Asia. Asia, yeah, that, that, yeah, that's right. It's like Asia, e- Anderson or Ederson or some shit yeah, like that. You got it. You got it. Yeah. They see you already prepared. Yes. Yeah. Like, uh, <laughs> uh, but uh, she plays. What does she play on? She's an actress. She plays on some a fairly popular TV show too. Um, I'll look it up real quick, but. Anyway, I don't know. I'm bad in my free time. Is what the fuck she plays on. <laughs> <laughs> so she's back there, and, and if you look at the beginning of the video, like he does slap her on the butt. He's, she's got her hands on his inner thigh. I mean, something is going on. Like, oh yeah, no, yeah, there's like, something. That I don't feel so, like that's up to question. We all know what was going on. All right, Ek, what's your thoughts, bro? Look, man. My thing is, <laughs> obviously, you can't do shit no more, man. They're making it hard. They're right, making right. not want to be a rapper no more, bro. You can't do shit. If I can't slap bitches in the ass when I feel like it, <laughs> what are we here for? <laughs> right. Like, I don't know how you got, like, that's a, that's backstage. Like, we were kind of talking about this one a little bit before. Like, I feel like, I'm not on yet, but I feel like backstage is going to be like, that's like the locker room or some shit. Come on, man. Like, that's not, that's supposed to stay there. I'm more, I'm yeah. more mad. I'm not saying that she T.I. didn't do something wrong. Las Vegas, every backstage. I feel like I'm like, if someone got hurt at my at my, at my place of employment where I, I own it, I own a business and someone got hurt there, like, yeah, I still, they, he still got to take all the liability. It's his fault. He did it. But, like, you got to be, like, on safety and shit. Like, I don't know. You can't just, like, let that shit happen. Like, there's, that's a problem. I don't know. <laughs> I'm on some other shit about I gotta it. laugh. I gotta laugh. I'm watching these videos and I'm like, man, she kind of bad. Oh, yeah. but uh, that's why you said bad in my free time. Yeah. Nah, but I mean, you know, T.I., you a married man with several. He got about nine children. I mean, I'm not trying to act like the perfect dude because Lord knows I'm not. But like, you gotta move with a little bit more discretion or you just don't care about your lady. Like, that's what I feel like. Like, if you're going to move reckless, then obviously you're not concerned about what she's going to do. And T.I. probably not concerned because he's she's still ain't left. I mean, he, he's cheating on her with, like, 60 women, and she still ain't left. So, so I mean, it seems like it's just accepted actions at this point. Like, he knows he's going to do that, and she's going to get over it. And It's like when Arnold Schwarzenegger was cheating with his fucking maid. Like, I just feel like the guy wins so much. Like, he, like nothing in his life ever goes wrong. He probably feels like he can always get away with it. I mean, he's famous. He can go into places and say stupid shit. Because I'm question Nagy's made, made was not bad. No, like, she's not. But, but. He made that decision. He hey, was but sometimes fucking, it'd be convenient, though. Like, that's what I'm saying. He's he fucking his maid in his house, in his bed. And it's like, how could you think you'd get away with that? And it's like, because I'm Arnold fucking Schwarzenegger. I became the fucking governor of California. And I talk all retarded. Like, you know what I mean? Like, but he still made it happen. So I believe anything. He can't. He, can, he probably thinks he can do anything. Well, and my thing too is like she's in his house, like half naked, cooking him food and shit. Like that's that's difficult. Like, see this to yeah, me. Yeah, that's kind of fucked up for his wife to be seeing that. This shit. is this is way more controllable to me. Like she's coming to your show. You can have her wait until you get to the hotel. 
You know what I'm saying? You, you ain't even got to have her there. I'd be like, look, man, you sit in the crowd. I'll see you later. But the, the Arnold Schwarzenegger thing, she five feet away from him with no drawers on cleaning something. I mean, that's just a tough situation. Like, <laughs> any, any man I hire, she going to be old. Because I don't even need that kind of stress, dog. Like, nah, you need to be 90. In your 90. I'm good. Like, Yeah, I always think about I that, bro. I can't have no maid, bro. I just can't have no maid. Or secretary. That would be bad. Wait a too. minute. So even if she was like, like in her sixties, you still, you still drop it in the tank? <laughs> I, I, no, I wouldn't hire no old sixties bitch though. <laughs> <laughs> if I can't, if I can't get with the maid, what's the fucking point? Right. <laughs> dumb. I'm gonna see some dreary ass bitch every day. That's not what I want. <laughs> he said dreary. <laughs> Bro, hey, for, have y'all ever been at like a hotel room or like a place where like it was a bad cleaning lady? Because never in my life have I seen an attractive cleaning lady. I, I think it's a myth. I don't know. It's a myth. Like Kanye, Kanye, Kanye West said, just one time. Yeah, that's piece of bad. It's never fucking happened on any level. No, yeah. fuck no. Well, it's like the same thing with my neighbors. I've never had an attractive neighbor either, like ever in my life. You know? uh, yeah, I don't think I've had that situation a lot of times. I haven't. I, that, never in my life does that happen to me. I, you know, I take it back. I take it back. One time, I was actually living in North Scottsdale, and my neighbor, oh. she was bad, but she was, she was out of her mind. You know, she was crazy. Oh, it's like her crazy, like, negated her attractiveness. No, everything. Like, 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 she called me over one night to do yoga with her, right? Like, yoga. Like, what? So I'm thinking, I'm thinking this is an invitation. You know, I'm excited. You know what I mean? To so that. I try to make my little move, and she throws me out. <laughs> I'm like, it's not it's like a night we do a yoga for real. Like you really expected me to come over and do yoga? Like, come on. right, bitch? What did you to believe that I had any yoga skills, nigga? This is like something you work up to. And, and I'm not a small dude. Like, come on, man! I don't do no goddamn yoga. You're no better than that. But what? I just left. It was better that than getting shot that night by the police. Yeah, fuck yeah. that. Just get the fuck out. I mean, any last any last comments on this joint right here? I mean, I just think that. Like, this isn't the last we're going to see of it. I think, just like all the time, one of the biggest things I'd say is, bro, t- Tip does that all the time. That's why he was doing that with so much comfort and never oh, gets okay. caught. Like, he never gets caught. You know what I mean? So that's usually probably a safe sp- safe space for him. But now i got to be making sure no... Oh, do- oh, oh, you mean behind... You mean... Uh, uh, little bitch-ass niggas recording you in the crevice. So yeah, exactly. Now I'm going to be like that every time. Duct tape. Tape up all the hoes. No roaches, no crevice cameras, none of that shit. Yeah, exactly. Now I'm always going to be like, it might not even be, it could be a little fucking dude with that fucking his phone. No, check the crevice every time. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that, I mean, the way he got caught up is bogus, though. I mean, that, that it's truly a new day and age. I mean, we, we've come from a, a, a time where the president could get head in his office and nobody know until he busts on the dress. And nowadays, you can't even slap a girl in the ass backstage at your own show. I mean, I maliciously. <laughs> I, li- I like how you defending the slap. You're like, come on, bro. It wasn't even that bad of a slap. It wasn't. I, I seen way worse. That's what we're here for. What are we here for? <laughs> I mean, let's see Why are we alive? <laughs> I mean, what's the point of being tip if you can't? Right. Okay, see that? Come on, that's smooth. She was just sitting down. Now, nah, look at that hand in the upper thigh, though. She going, for some, she going D-level. She going nah, D-level they were quick. just working out. <laughs> I like I like how Griff got the whole backstory covered. He's like, nah, man, she just came from the gym. Yeah, that's you know. right. He's like, good gym. He's gonna work out. That's what it is. I, I want to know where in the concert venue the person was standing to get this video. Right, had to get I, over I, there. Bitch niggas up the area, obviously. Is what? He was standing in the bitch nigga only area. <laughs> Oh, hey, shit. I like how you're seriously offended by what took place here. <laughs> hey, I, I noticed that was... I was like, ain't this some goddamn shit? <laughs> that was my immediate response, too. I'm not going to lie. Hey, yeah, she, I mean, she, she she's right, though. I mean, at least if you're going to do it, do it, the, do it the right way. I mean... Don't sound like Arnold's maid on the ass. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> nah. Now I got to look up Arnold's maid because I'm curious. Was she, was she really terrible? Yeah, she wasn't good. You know what I mean? Like... But I would say, what's funny is the kid looks more like him than his own kids. Yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking this up right The now. kid just looks like Mexican Arnold Schwarzenegger, and all his other kids kind of look like him. 
right, man. Let's uh, let's roll off. Let's this wrap one. this one I up. I got nothing else to say. I got nothing else to say about Tip and his shenanigans. Poor instead, tip. instead of stay out the bitch nigga only zone is uh, is, is EK calls. Just close the door. You don't need to deal with them. Yeah, that's just bad. Close the door and then uh, bring a sheet. Bring it. <laughs> Pull up on your bitch on the east side, yeah. Guarantee she let the